You're watching Middle Georgia Pride, only on 41 NBC News at 6. Today we continue our first week of Middle Georgia Pride in Dublin. The heart of Georgia has hundreds of volunteers, but one stands out. Her passion is to make the city a more beautiful place to live. 41 NBC's Liz Foster has the story of Dublin's hometown hero. 25 years ago, 77-year-old Togi Bryson and her husband took a road trip out west. Togi noticed many of the small towns along the way had flowers everywhere she looked. And I thought, why can't Dublin do that? So she started with two small plots at Dublin City Hall. And it's just gradually grown and grown and grown. This is our garden. Four years ago, when this farmer's market was built, Togi drew the plans for the lot and worked her green thumb. She basically took what was an old drainage ditch and made it a beautiful garden. Anything that's beautiful in the city, um, Togi has her hand in it, and she just, it's, what she does is magical. Togi now maintains several gardens around downtown Dublin and planted more than 2,000 flowers this spring alone. Togi says she couldn't do it without help from prisoners. She motivates them to get a job, join a church, and better themselves when they get out. I feel like if I can turn one of their lives around, that is worth my time and effort. And it seems to be working. She got choked up when telling us about a Mother's Day card and flower pot the prisoners <laughs> gave her as a thank you for what she's done for them. She has a real love for the community, and she wants to beautify the community, and, and, she's, and she's talented. She has that gift. In 2006, the organization Keep Georgia Beautiful awarded Togi Woman of the Year. It was quite an honor. She just is a hero because she's always willing to volunteer her time and never asks for anything in return. And, um, and she really, I don't know what, what we would do without her. This modest hometown hero didn't brag on her own accomplishments when asked what she's most proud of. Come this December, all three of my grandchildren will have graduated from college. And, and I'm just quite proud of my family. In Dublin, Liz Foster, 41, NBC News. Togi still takes care of the grounds at City Hall and several areas around downtown, but she's scaled back her efforts to once a week. When asked what's next, she said she takes everything one day at a time.